Hello everybody, I'm Skulkin and welcome back to To The Moon. Where we left off is we have Johnny who's dying. We have a load of random rabbits and I'm about to put on a helmet to, I don't know, travel inside his dreams or something. So let's we find out where I was. I said it was on Cypher, is it here? Initiate. Okay, so let's get straight into this then. Maybe make some sense out of the rabbit. Alright, here we go. I'm not going to be doing the voice for this because I don't think I'll be able to keep it up all the way and I can't really remember what they were anyway. Okay, so I'm assuming we're going into his mind. Maybe into like his past memories. This should be the last accessible memory. Disable speech for all except Johnny. Done. Let's get him. Let's get him. Okay. At any time you can view your position in time by moving the mouse towards the top of the screen. Okay. Oh, okay. So I guess we just have to find where Johnny is then. Where is Johnny? Assume see if I've got anything. Johnny's still doing fine. No, still no notes. Oh, maybe that... Ooh, I'm wondering if that toy passport will come in handy, actually. Uh, outside, maybe? Ooh, lighthouse. Oh, yeah, that's right. They mentioned... He may have put it there last week before he fell ill. Johnny? What a pleasant surprise. We don't get many visitors around here. My name is Dr. Eva Rosaline, and this is Dr. Von Matterhorn. Dr. Lorenzo Von Matterhorn. Dr. Neil Watts. Are you familiar with the Sigmund Agency of Life Generation? Oh, are you two from the agency? How convenient. I've just been thinking of calling you. Lily, get us some tea, please. Lily? Actually, you've already called us. We're here to fulfill our contract from the relative future. Careful there. If you slip off the cliff, we're going to have to reload this memory. Watch it, Neil. Show some respect. Uh, it's just a program, you know. I know, but this is his last accessible memory. We need his cooperation. Worst comes to worst, we can just reboot it. Why would you want to waste life? Why would you want to waste time like that? You. You're here to take me to the moon, aren't you? Yes, John. I suppose I had a good run. Not good enough, it seems. So, can you do it? Can you take me to the moon? We can't, but you might be able to. Why do you want to go there? I don't know. It's fine, you can tell us. It's essential for helping us to get you there. Do you want the fame? The money? You've got to have a motive. I'm sorry, but I really don't know. I just do. I can already tell this is going to be a pain in the ass. Nevertheless, Johnny, here's what we'll do. We need to get to your childhood, but it is too distant to do so in one memory hop. Thus, we will need to traverse through your memories with gradual backward leaps which you've given us the permission to do in the relative future. Once we lay down the waypoints in your childhood memories for direct access, we will return here. That's when you'll need to help us influence the childhood you to become an astronaut. Or to get on a giant catapult. The point is, you'll need to have more 
to say than just I don't know. As long as you can take me to the moon, I'll cooperate in any way possible. Good. Now, in order to leap to a memory, we need an item that is of um, that is of importance to you. Do you have a memento of some sort to get us started? That'll do. Well, shall we? Ladies first. Don't we already have this rabbit? Ah, oh, no, no. We need to prepare this memento first. Memento? Repair, I guess. Oh my god. Complete the memento. Clip the orbs to flip this. Oh, okay. I'm sort of confused by how that works, but I'll, I'll go with it. Yeah, it's just loading. A lot of speech at the moment. Sorry if I end up screwing up any of the actual text. Okay, activate. Wait, what about my privacy? We'll try not to violate what we can avoid. But in most cases, it can't be helped. Bloody hell, he likes rabbits. Oh, we have the platypus. Turn off visibility and interactivity. I, it'd be messy to be seen. Yeah, yeah, happy. Jeez, what's with all these rabbits? This is creeping me out. We probably should have checked his record for psychopathy first. What the? Did he hear me? That's impossible. It's probably just part of his memory. Then I stand by my point. Anyway, quit blabbering and find a memento to here to hop from. It's going to be the platypus that stands out. Wait, we have the rabbit again. Check. Multicolored paper rabbit. Well, aren't you special, having two colours when all of your siblings look like they drowned in bleach? What's that? You think you're really creepy? Why, yes, I agree. Okay, do we have to collect... Oh. Umbrella. Wow, you can only walk a few steps at once, come on. Wait, what? Requires memory links to shoot. Oh, okay. I think I sort of understand that. Is there anything? Yeah, no. Okay, can we go upstairs then? Let's see what we have upstairs. I'm kind of confused about how this works. But it intrigues me more than anything. Is that his dad? There's something at least. Pickled olives. Peh, I hate this stuff. What's to hate? It's pickled olive. Exactly. Really? A pickled olive memento? Oh, an old and patched up backpack. What is this? A million years old? I guess we'll find out. Okay, I would have thought that would be a memento. A memento more than pickled olives. The Emperor's New Clothes by Hans Christian Alderson. I don't really want to rush through this too much, but I don't think there's really much else I can do apart from what it wants me to. Fresh wildflowers. Okay, switch me something reddish. Don't. If we have to explain our presence to him at every memory, I'd go crazy. Don't tempt me. So, maybe down the basement, then. We can go to the basement. So yeah, I'm definitely thinking it's that platypus. Because that's sort of brownie red. 
apparently not, then it actually has colour. In the world, the scene is pretty see through. Can I not go down? I'm assuming this black stuff attached around the screen means I can't go there. What else is there? Oh, clock. The clock's moving, but, sound, but the sound is. Receive no clock. There we go. Let's fly out of here on an umbrella. Memory links established. You can now travel with the Memento Umbrella. Hadouken! What the... was that? What? That's it. I'm doing the breaking from now on. Oh, what happened? Maybe it was the Hadouken. Okay. Reminder, the corner orb can flip the entire... Ah, oh, I didn't even notice the corner orb before. Okay, so you want to try and get three. I don't know how you... Uh... Ooh. Yeah, it only flips that way. Um... Oh, wait, one, two. There we go. <laughs> I don't know whether that actually makes a difference or not. Okay, we can now actually travel. Activate. Gone to a stormy place now. When it comes to rain, through is better than onto. <laughs> I don't mind it regardless. Seems like these memory hops only span a short period of time. We need to find a leaping memento, or it's going to take forever. Meh, just enjoy the scenery. So whereabouts are we? Wow, we really are going short distances. If we've got to go all the way back to his... Like, there. It's going to take ages. But I'm not necessarily against that. It's definitely fun. It's definitely intriguing. <laughs> An old stuffed toy platypus. Honestly, I just don't think this animal has the right to exist. The world's not big enough for two of you. It's definitely going to be in the lighthouse. Requires three bars of memory links to proceed. Okay, so I need one more. We've got... There we go. The memory of Rivery Wild. It's finished, River. Like you, I'll be able to watch over her every day. She won't be alone anymore. I might never understand why, but I stay true to your wish. I'm sure Anya is grateful to you too. But when I'm gone, who is going to watch over us? Oh, it's going to be sad, isn't it? Oh no, am I now visible? Who are you? My name is Eva. I was just passing by. Was she your wife? Yes, her name was River. That's a special name. It didn't need to happen. Hmm? She, she didn't need to do it. But she... You wouldn't understand. I don't even understand. And now I'm gone. be very good on the story, I can just tell. Right? It already brings a tear to my eye. Receive note, Anya. Anya, where do I recognise that name from? Oh god, I don't actually have to walk up these stairs. About time you got here. I almost thought you fell off the cliff. 
What were you doing? Enjoying the scenery. What else? Any luck here? Big luck. Huge. Dinosauric. Huh? This place looks pretty empty. It's a lighthouse. What do you expect? Anyway, I'll catch you on the other side. Have fun re-breaking the barrier for yourself. Wow, what a douche. Okay, it's gotta be it's gotta be this. Broken lighthouse lamp. And the only other thing here. Oh. I don't know who that is. Is that him again? And we have the platypus. Ciao, 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 ciao. Memento, prepare. Ideal shows the minimum amounts of moves the memento can be completed in. Okay. Oh yeah. One, two, three. Oh. That wasn't four moves, that was like six, I think, I don't know. Activate. Let's go into the next one. Hopefully let's find something that moves us slightly further into the past. Not necessarily as depressing though. Just enough. After we pay for your operation, we'll have just enough left for it. So you don't so don't you lie. White lie. That's what you call it, right? No, I'm sure we can just stop it. I don't like it when you lie. I calculated our finances. I know how it's like. Why do you try and convince me against my will? We need the money for your medical bills, River. I understand that Anya means a lot to you, but this, this is just too much. I mean, she, she isn't even, do you know what makes me happy, Johnny? What? Do you? Well, I do. I just hope you can help me with it. River. When the papers for my treatments get here, I will not sign them. What you do with our money is up to you. But if you grant me what I wish, I want you to use it to finish building that house. And then, for every day that you live there, I want you to watch over her. Visit her. Speak to her. Comfort her. I don't want her to be alone anymore. And what about you? Happy. I'll be happy. Johnny? Yes? I made this. Oh, tell me what it is. What? Just tell me what it is. It's a rabbit. It's a rabbit, like all the others you made. What else? Um, it's made of paper. What else? Its body is yellow and the rest is blue. Good. What else? Look, River. I wrote a song. It's for you. Okay. Well, would you like to hear it? Yes. You didn't have to bring the piano in here for this. I can hear you just fine with the door open. Oh, you saw him close his eyes. Oh. It's called Forever. Why so cliche? It's just a placeholder. <laughs> Who is this Anya they were talking about? If she's so important, shouldn't we have seen her in his late memories? 
I guess he didn't keep that promise after all. Unless... I knew the platypus. Unless what? Never mind. Hey, that's the same song the kids were playing earlier, huh? I guess he taught them. You know what? I'm too manly for this. I'm heading on. I already got my memory links. Do you want to hitch a quick ride or look around for yourself? I saw her on a Zen Explore. Go on ahead. I'll catch up with you. Don't you miss the days when memory audio to MP8 conversion was legal? I think I brought home over 2,000 songs during my first year on this job. Okay, it's kind of nice that I have everywhere to look, actually. Excuse me, Paper Rabbit. Got the book. The Emperor's New Clothes by Hans Christian Andersen. It's definitely becoming very touching now. No, forever. I'm assuming the plants thing at the end. It's kind of an odd thing, though. Okay, let's see what we've got around the rest of the house. Maybe it's just gonna keep them playing. I don't want to have a tear in my eye throughout the game. Who are these? Guys, this thing. Nicholas, I'm telling you that. There's just no way. What if we take it apart? Okay. Who else, John? We aren't exactly at the right age of piano moving. You know what? If this means that much to you, I'll pay for the professionals to do this. I can't help saving that hell. I can't help saving that house for you. So this is the least I can do. Okay, so there's a guy called Nicholas. Glass of someone really likes it. They just they're probably the same bottle as well. A, mi a pot of mixed dough. Okay, we've got everything. Is there anywhere else we can head? No, that's it. Oh, and you can hear the music get louder as you get closer. Is there an end or will it keep on? I think it keeps on, but I don't want to stand around here for ages. We'll probably carry on hearing the song. It's very nice here. Let's go, plant. Take me away. Okay. We go across. Do not. Won't worry about the idea. We'll probably end up breaking up the deal with this thing. Yeah, I need to do it. Oh, I might have to edit this. I don't know why I've done that. Okay, there we go. Okay, that didn't take too long. But that was rather. You can do that in four moves. Speed and hell. Activate the momentum. Let's activate the bomb. I have to find that song. I think you can actually go to their website and it has their music there. So I'll make sure to link it in the description if I find it. Finally. Why did he just leave as soon as I got here? Oh well. Oh no, he's, he's with me. Okay, we can jump that. Oh, it's not a bridge there actually. Oh, okay. Oh, where? really meant to be looking, or what we're meant to be looking for. Let's open that up. Okay, so that is slightly younger age. Heh. <laughs> Look what we have here. Oh Christ, the house is barely built. I bet they saw this cliff and thought it was not dangerous enough without people living on it. He is worn out. Nick called and said I should come. I bought you pickled olives. They're your favourite, right? 
I heard about River. Will she be okay? Her illness was just diagnosed in its late stage. Fortunately, it's treatable. For the medical bills. You can't afford to finish building this house, Isabel. You can barely afford to pay for her treatment. I'm just relieved that she'll be okay, but... I don't know how much this place means to her. She's going to be heartbroken. I'd help, but Tim and I have been barely getting by since the market crashed. What are you going to do now? I'm, I'm going to tell her that we can make it. I'm going to tell her that we can afford everything. I don't want her to do anything crazy. I shouldn't lie to her. You don't understand, Isabel. If she found out, I'm not sure which she'd choose. So what? If she chooses not to save herself for the sake of this place, then so be it. If that's what she really wants. I really dislike when you neurotypicals think that you know what's best for others. I hate when you call me that, Izzy. Do you think this is all about her? What about me, Isabel? After all these years, am I not allowed to be selfish even once? I don't want to be alone, Isabel. I'm not going to let her die. That's arrogant. I don't care. Where are you going? I'm going to pick something from this cliff and bring it back to her. It'll at least give her comfort. That doesn't make what you're doing any less wrong. Nick wanted me to give you this. Why's oh, the music box? He said it's called Everything's Alright. It isn't. <laughs> really sad because I can see where he's coming from but I also see where she's coming from oh, I don't know I don't know who I'd go with I'd probably go with him oh okay some people got lives that yeah, what else we got what else we got around here not really much else oh the memento he's going to go pick for her I don't know what it's going to be actually there wasn't much up there Maybe it's a rabbit. <laughs> Let's see what we got up here. Oh. Oh, it's a flower. Oh, is it going to be yellow and blue? I can't go over there. That's kind of sad. What else have we got? Okay, so we need something blue. We need something yellow. Can I actually go over there and just don't know it, or... I don't know, is there something else over here? Look at that extra long truck. Okay, the truck was a thing. What else have I got, though? I don't think I've got much else to... I don't know. Not much else to go on, really. I don't know, I can explore the place a bit more, which is nice. Can I sprint yet? Nope, still can't sprint. This may take a while. Okay, there's nothing down there then. Is that weird flower? Nope. Okay. There really isn't much else. I mean, we've got the whole edge. So I'm assuming there might be something around here, but I can't see anything. Let's wander into the trees. When you're out the trees, you get stuck. Okay. I don't know. I don't know. Something that it's almost something that would mean something to him, but a lot of the time it does just seem to be random things. Like I can understand the pickled olives. I don't know. They're his favourite, but I don't. Know. I don't know the man. Nothing over here. This is just an unused area. Oh come on! It's such a nice place. With all this floating, all these floating islands. 
Wow, Neil must think I'm an idiot. I'm gonna come over a little faster. I don't know what else you'd want. I mean, workbench. That kind of makes sense. It will be the workbench. Is there anything I can click on? No, apparently not. Oh, was that something? No, nope, nothing. See, I got to from going up there, so I don't think there'd be any more. I don't see anything else, though. Okay, so what I'll do is I'll leave it here. I'll find it off cam, and we'll get back into the next place. So this has been To The Moon, and we're really starting to understand sort of Johnny's life now. And it's kind of sad. You can see how he slowly gets depressed as his wife chooses to die over not building the house. I don't know. So this has been Skull Kid from To The Moon, and we'll see you in the next part. Bye-bye.